Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. Today we'll be unboxing the Omen Reactor um, Gaming Mouse, which is the white version. Um, it looks pretty good from the packaging. There it is on the back. Um, so let's get into it. Damn, I just realized my mic is going to be in the way. So, you be presented to the mouse as soon as you open it. Right there. Um, so let's just get started. Okay, so we'll start off with this. So you get some iron stickers, um, which is pretty cool. So open that up. I'm guessing this will be instructions and all that. Um, first one is about the mouse, I'm guessing. Yep, how, how you set it up and all that. It's pretty simple. Um, probably warranty stuff. Yep, more stuff. Here we go. These are the stickers. Don't know if the stickers really matter, but they're cool. I'll put them to something. Um, now we're at the mouse bit here. So at the back, you got your cable, so I'm guessing you just lift this up. There we go. And we are presented to the mouse. To the mouse cable, that is. There we go. Now we're going to get the actual thing out, which. Hmm, am I really? Oh, I see. Gotta repeat the sides. There we go. Stick the And now I don't think we need that box anymore. So now we have the mouse. Um, there are some switches on the side here. Yeah, I don't know if it actually does. Oh, it's a spring! Now that's cool. I don't know if I like want it like that, but that's awesome. So there's this switch here. Sorry. Uh, right where my pointer finger is right here so if you push this in one direction that moves so you could play like that if you want so like that or you could just go normal mouse um and it's got you know your thumb it's got your thumb grip there yeah I'm really bad at unboxing right here uh, DPI scroll that's sick side buttons feel good so yeah that's awesome feels really it's it's small it's smaller than my other mouse but it feels more I feel like I can do more with if that makes sense but I love that spring so if I want it like halfway I can no I don't like it halfway I like it full full mouse mode that's awesome um with this mouse it, it feels a bit more gliding like my hands feel like it's gonna slip off but with with this mouse here because it's heavy it, it stays to the ground but with this one it feels more I guess because it's lighter but um I'm gonna We'll play some games on some games with it, and um, I'll see you guys soon with me playing some games. All right. Okay, everyone. Um, sorry about that. How I couldn't show you any gameplay. It's just I don't have much shooter games anymore. 
I'm all... I have rust, but you know, OBS won't run that for me. And I do have a lot of shitty games, so I just don't have them installed. But we're going to be comparing my old mouse, which is the, the TT... TT Esports Tay Long, I think that's how you say it. Came with a free mouse pad. Um, but yeah, it was like 30 bucks why I pick it up. It does have lights, but I have turned them off because they're a bit bright. Um, now we have the Omen. My new mouse, Omen Reactor. I think it's, yeah, the Omen Reactor white gaming mouse. Um, let's just start off from the appearances of it. So, with this one, you can tell it's a bit bigger. It's a, you can, it's a bit more wider compared to the Omen. Um, so, with this one, you have like a, it comes out and then back in, but with the Omen, it's just basically straight on. Um, with the Omen, you do have the thumb holder, right here. And with this one, you do as well, but it's not as wide out, if that makes sense. It's, if you can see that, it's right there. Um, I like the white one more. I just like the color white in like keyboards and mouses look really clean. Uh, the only problem is you can't really get them dirty, but I really wanted to upgrade, and that's why I bought the Omen Reactor. Only sixty-three dollars. Um, now w with the weight, Omen's definitely more lighter, so it will be more gliding. My old one, I used to have to pick up, pick up, and all that. Um, the design on this, on the Omen, looks a lot more cleaner. Just has more to it. This one's just basic. You know, you have the lights, but that's really it. Which I'll just turn off real quick. Okay, no, no, not gonna turn off. Oh, there we go. Um, they both have DPIs. Scroll wheels. You know, right click, left click. Of course, they do have side buttons. These are really small. I know you can't see unless I do something. I don't know if you can see that, but um, the buttons are really small. And on the Omen, they are a lot more bigger. Um, and this button on here was starting to break, so it's a good thing I got that. Um, length of the cable, Omen's definitely longer, I have it dropping down behind my desk. Uh, with the TT Esports, it's not as long, but I like it more long, um, more long cable. In my opinion, this helped me a lot, so if you're looking for a cheap mouse, I recommend the TT Esports. But the reason I bought this one is, it's... It's more what I like, the style, the thumb holder, buttons are bigger, and just lighter. I like lighter mouses. But with this one, if you, I don't know, move mouse. With this one, if I hold this up, the springs pop up. So it's a spring right here on the mouse. And you can play like this, have the, you know, this mouse bit popping up or you can bring it down to the middle it's really up to you I keep it all the way down because I'm just used to that from this mouse but yeah that's pretty much it for the Omen mouse um, I would recommend it to anyone if they want to buy them I'll have the link down below to JB High Five's um, mouse I got it from but yeah, that's it. I hope you guys uh, enjoyed the video. Remember to like and subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. Dance like there's no tomorrow. Hey! Hey!